Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Transfer, another one by Nia. Uh, this one is a medium to hard difficulty, no special skills required, and it's a puzzle for CTM contest number 10, Reflect Twice. Maybe a clue to what we need to do here. So without further ado, let's jump into the map. Let's see what we can do. Reflect Twice. So it's going to be, in my opinion, a laser puzzle of some sort, using a laser cube. I would surmise. All right, so not a lot we can do there. Exits on a timer. Okay, can't go through there. Blocking that. Where was? Where's square? This could be square. There's square. Excellent. All right. Looks quite complicated off the bat, which um, may or may not be good. Haven't decided yet. Let's explore the map to its fullest first before we decide to make any rash decisions and judgments. There's something in there which we need to get. It's another cube. We have something here which we can turn on now, and that will... Disable that and allow us to get through to the exit for now. So let's just check that that is the only requirement for the exit, that button. Make sure it doesn't do anything else. Yeah, it's a pretty short timer. So we're going to have a uh, portal surface there and a portal surface here, so we just run through the portals and, and exit, it seems. So it's almost like we need to get a portal in there and work our way backwards. Alright, what do we got over here? It's probably a way in to get this other cube, right? It is, and it is a reflector cube. Okay. So, with the reflector cube in hand, let's see if we can't start making progress of some shape. We can do that and that, but then we're blocked off from doing anything there, so that would be pretty pointless at this moment in time. Reflect over to here. Which would again not do a great amount of here. Goes through to here. I'll see if we can pull there. And because uh, it's not straight, it really doesn't help us. But that could be something. Yeah, that's going to be a way back through to there. So the first one we need to hit is there. Which is this one from here, right? Right. So with that and that, that opens up there. We walk through to here. And we then change the portal to there, potentially. To open up this. And then we do it to there to aim through to there. We can then put a portal into there. Getting a rough idea. I know I'm not making any progress yet, guys. But... Um We'll get there in a moment. We'll get there in a moment. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's all good. Right. There is an angle there, but I'm pretty sure that would be unintentional. Hmm. 
The pool surfaces we could see are... We need this one through to this side. So, we can actually take this one out right now. And we can take it back at any point by just recalling it. So, from here... We can aim it to here, like something like this, and that would activate, deactivate the laser and also give us that as well, right? So, yeah, if we now aimed it over in this direction, that gives us a portal on there and access through to, so we can do that and that, which disables the section over there, or we could change the black portal to there, which is going to be the more helpful one at this point. Okay, sweet. So that's progress one. I'm probably going to save that there. That's good progress. Then we change it to there, and then we change it to there. Really? Change it to there. Which is all well and good. But that portal surface baffles me. Why would we want a portal surface there? We can do that and that, which gets us back over to here. But we have no way to then do anything with that one. And now we have to go back and restart. Less. Oh, that was the wrong portal. That serves me right for not using like input outputs for the first time around. And assuming I had the same setup the second time, which clearly I didn't. Um, so, do that. Do that. Now we can go to here, and we can set this one to here, but to what avail? But to what avail? Almost like we need to Right, what if that was close to the fizzler? So here we can. Well, if we went over like here, we could potentially cause like a respawn.
so we do that. That doesn't matter. That's not quite right. Oh, you know what? We don't need to. Sh we need to leave that one to pull the cube through. I think. Yeah, let's try that. All right. Man, this is. Um Alright, so, we do that. Oh, but then we're going to lose... No, that won't work. Because we jump through there, we lose that portal on there. And the fizzler just turns on again, right? Right. Let's read it safe. Another thing worth noting is is what? I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that statement. Sorry. What if I could get the other cube in there? I'm not sure that really does anything for me at all. That laser is really not straight, is it? At all. Seriously. Hmm. <laughs> Trying to decide whether or not having the laser fields is a permanent requirement. Not entirely sure. Well, the only way to get back over here is. By putting a portal here. So if I have a portal here, 
or anywhere here. You see my problem at the minute, I still don't see what that is for there. I don't see what that one's for. I've heard the laser coming out of here though. I don't know what good that would actually do for me. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. So this doesn't turn off. something different. We can just try it. I mean, it's not going to hurt to try, right? It's going to turn the laser field on temporarily anyway, but I'm just trying to think if we can get the, like, get, get the cube move like into a different, a different position anywhere. So, we did that. And then we did that. The cube. And pointed the cube there. So we do that. See, now we have the option we could do... That could be the one. Alright. So, let me remember what we did before. Put the cube out. Go away. Don't hit me with your laser beam. Hit me with your laser beam. Alright, so that's probably about where we're going to want to go aim for. Over here. Can we see it? We can see it. Now, can we see it without turning this off as well? Yes, we can. Excellent. Alright, so now... We do... This... This... And then we do... This. Now, at this point, I can actually bring a cube through to here. So let me save it here. And then we're going to bring the cube through by recalling. All right. So now, we're going to re-angle that other cube to here. So we'll through here just to be quicker. Then it goes through here. We walk all the way around again. La, 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 la. All right, so now we're here. We can now do... This, this, and we can do this. Okay. This, I feel, is progress. Good progress. Alright, so now we do this. 
I'm going to save again. And we're going to want to now turn this cube this way. Which gives us this one. That. That's pretty freaking sweet. If I turn it like that. So that becomes now our new portal. Hold on. No, 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 no. Let me do this. I think I'm there. I think I've done it. Uh, that. That. Now we can walk through here. Hit that. And now I have my portals in position. And I'm through here. Through here. And I'm done. That's a really cool puzzle. Another cool puzzle near. I don't think I've, I've played your maps, but that's two fantastic maps of yours that I have played. Um, that one, again, will get um, a thumbs up and added to my favourites. Very cool. Very cool puzzle indeed, guys. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any maps you'd like me to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Discord. Find a link to that in the description where you'll find my map suggestions channel. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming.